There are a number of free antivirus software packages available in the market, and which one's the best is highly debatable. For that reason, I have selected Avast Antivirus as our antivirus of choice for this series. That does not mean all other free antiviruses, such as AVG Free Edition or Panda, which is a real popular one, are good. Of course they're good. They're actually very good as, as in terms of detection rates and scan times. But I've just had the best luck with Avast. Now you can find Avast at my website at pcmtechhelp.com forward slash downloads. And it'll be in the first section called the anti-malware section. I took the liberty of already downloading this antivirus software. It's right here, as you can see, Avast Home Edition. And uh, it's completely free for personal use. All you need to do is register, but we'll talk about that in the next video. In this video, we'll just be installing it. So let me go ahead and open up my downloads because I have already downloaded it, and let's walk through the installation of Avast. I'm gonna go ahead and select it to start the installer. It'll of course prompt me by user account control, and I'll select yes. This will bring up my Avast installation. Now the nice thing about Avast is it's made astounding strides in actual ease of use and detection rates, as well as usability. We can go ahead and select Express Install just to get a very clean installation. It says, free antivirus does collect some information from your computer, including some personal information. They promise they will never use or share that information to third parties, which is a good, good thing. But if you don't agree to that, then don't agree to it. Then I'm gonna select next and the installation will take place. Now Avast makes lots of money based on actually people upgrading their plan from the free antivirus to the professional antivirus. That does not mean you have to, but they do offer additional protection to those of you who want additional protection or features if you so choose to upgrade. Personally, I think that the free antivirus is more than adequate for most users, so there's no real need to upgrade significantly for your free antivirus software unless you're into scrupulous activities. And for those of you who are doing that, you know who you are. I always have to push heavily at the pcmtechhelp.com forward slash community. At our community page, I, we always talk about antivirus software, and we're actually very, very strongly convinced that it's mostly based on user behavior. And if you have any questions or concerns about antivirus, maybe, make sure you jump into the free community and ask at any time. So it says, I have 30 days of protection. Now that is the case for the initial loading. We have to register to get our full year of, addition, of uh, antivirus. So I'm going to select next. Oh, let me go ahead and close the Windows Update notification. Then I'm going to click Finish. And this is going to actually bring up my Avast free antivirus software interface. Welcome to Avast. Notice that it actually prompted me in the bottom right-hand corner. It's doing the initial startup scan, and it said, Welcome to Avast. Now it's recommending that I install the online security plugin for Google Chrome. This is completely free, and I do recommend you go ahead and select Install Now, and then select scan Add. has been completed. The nice thing about Google Chrome in this particular case is it actually is a very simple installation. I just clicked Add, and there we go. I am good to go. I have online security installed on my machine. Now let me go ahead and bring up Avast. I'm just going to select the little arrow in the bottom right hand corner of my screen and double click on Avast to bring it up. Here is the interface and we're going to be talking about a little bit more about this in the next video because in the next video we're going to actually do the full registration and go through a software overview. But this free antivirus will uh, give you an adequate protection for most of your uh, most of users out there. So that's all there is I was going to talk about in this video. As always, my name is Craig Chamberlain. Don't forget to subscribe if you liked this video and like it as well. And stay tuned for the next video where we will talk about registering and going over the full setup of your Avast free antivirus. Thank you for watching the PCM Tech Help Show. I will see you in the next video.